from their neatly dressed military garb to their sophisticated guns and the unbridled security detail to the president, the elite special forces command's role is to keep President Museveni out of harm's way. For a leader who wields a lot of clout in the volatile Great Lakes region, Museveni is one of the most guarded. However, during a recent visit to Brussels to attend a European Union Africa summit, the host country refused to play to the security rules of engagement. Whereas the summit was meant to galvanize relations and for the AU to keep the immensely resource rich Africa from other potential suitors, what late unfolded perhaps suggests otherwise. Highly placed sources told NTV that a diplomatic spat unfolded when the Belgian authorities refused to allow the president's security guards to inspect the vehicle he had been given during his stay. According to practice, the president's guards always inspect the vehicle he travels in when he is abroad. But the Belgian authorities remained adamant, an incident which vexed the president. This embarrassing diplomatic spat comes at a time when the West continues to criticize the president for passing the anti-homosexuality bill amid his resentment. Now we also understand that he did not attend the summit, but instead delegated Honorable Sam Kutesa, Minister for Foreign Affairs, to attend it. The incident in the Belgian capital spilled over here upon the president's return. Last week, the Minister of Foreign Affairs wrote a protest note and summoned the Belgian envoy to Kampala to explain why authorities in his country embarrassed the president. Speaking to NTV by telephone, Foreign Affairs Permanent Secretary Ambassador James Mugume said it's true the Belgian ambassador was summoned. Uh, this incident, uh, yes, it took place, uh, but uh, the Belgian authorities have already apologized and regretted the incident, so we think um, it was a... It as a security incident, which um, we have accepted the uh, apologies and uh, regret. It is not clear yet whether this incident was carefully weighed to target certain African leaders. Kenya's Uhuru Kenyatta nearly missed the summit after Belgian authorities delayed to give the head of his presidential security, Edwin Bugwa, a travel visa. Mm. 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 Mm.